All right, well, the general idea of this video is that I'm gonna go head to head with the Tama Iron Cobra 900 and the DW5000. This is how they come. The Tama comes with a more toolbox looking case and the DW5000 comes with more of a luggage looking case. But in fairness, I will say that when you look at them straight away here, the Iron Cobra is a little bit larger. So the toolbox look is probably fine. And the same thing here, this one's a little smaller than the Iron Cobra. And the case isn't a piece of trash, it's a good case. You'll notice that I got these beaters reversed on the Iron Cobra because I want the slapping sound of that plastic on my batter head. And I also really don't like the sound of the felt, regardless of the maker. And over here on the 5000, I put some Trick Drums beaters. These are pretty sweet. Not a super fan of these, but you can reverse these. Everyone accepts that. But I'll tell you, don't let anyone tell you you can't reverse the Iron Cobras either. Because you can, and I've been doing it, and I've had them for about a month now. I'll be playing the Iron Cobras on the Ludwig 22-inch. I'll be playing the DW5000 on the Sonor 18-inch.